welcome back to my channel. Today, I got up before the boys, and that's something I've been trying to do a lot lately while I still can. Um, I'm going to read my Bible, start the day on a good note. getting back into journaling with my Bible time. I have been terrible about prioritizing this for like the last year, truthfully. Um, but I forgot like how nice it is to write out gratitude and like write out your prayers and then look back on them. But another thing I'm really trying to focus on right now is memorizing scripture. I think the baby's waking up for a morning feed, but Another thing I'm really trying to focus on is scripture memorization. So I'm going to write out some verses and cut them out. And then I'll probably put one like on my coffee maker, one on the fridge, and just places that we see a lot because I would really like to just like see them and repeat them in my head over and over and over and eventually memorize them. Um, but the one that I just wrote down is... James chapter 3, 17 and 18. But the wisdom from above is first pure, then peaceable, gentle, open to reason, full of mercy and good fruits, impartial and sincere, and a harvest of righteousness is sown in peace by those who make peace. And that's just like a really good reminder of the standard that we should hold ourselves to and like the wisdom that God gives us. If it's not pure, if it's not peaceable, gentle, open to reason, full of mercy and good fruits, impartial, it's not wisdom from the Lord, that's our flesh. And I just felt like that was really good. But I am going to have to go upstairs and feed the baby. Buzz to sing? Oh, here you can sit right here. Hi. Yo, just woke up for the day. I ended up having to stay in here and nurse him, but I didn't mind, so I just like read on my phone and laid with him, and then I went and laid with Belle for a little bit before he woke up, because I never get like one-on-one -on -one time to snuggle him. We're all up, I just popped a breakfast in the oven, but I'm going to switch, I'm putting Theo in these little fleece jammies, he loves fleece pajamas. They're from one of our favorite clothing companies for our kids, which is Carter's. And exciting news, guys, today's video is actually sponsored by Carter's. We all know and love Carter's. We all know Carter's, like the big baby company that most stores sell. Yeah, that's who it's from. You're gonna look so handsome. But I'm gonna get him changed. I'll talk more about them in just a minute. Guys, he is so big. He outgrew like all of his sizes. He turned three months old two days ago and he's in six month clothing. Even a mom, if you haven't reheated your coffee twice before 8 a.m., probably not. Thank you, Bonnie. For sure. Say excuse me, Bean. Bean, back up. Back up. He's gonna get you some more. Back up. Okay, all done. You go put it away. And we'll put the lid on. You grab the lid. Good job. You can put this on. Yeah. Mr. Happy Boy's just relaxing on his love every gym. I see you.
bet you could see them up here. Are they in there? Yeah. Wow, maybe they want some food. Here, they can use this one. It's time to get the boys ready. We've eaten breakfast, done the whole thing, so I'm gonna get them ready for the day. So that means it's time to change out of your comfy, comfy jammy. Yeah. These jammies are the best. My personal fave, favorite baby, whoa, favorite baby pajamas from Carter's are always the fleece ones. I just find, especially if you have a baby who gets cold at night, they sleep so well in these. They're buttery soft and they just are so, so, so comfy. But it's kind of a toss up because I also really, really love their toddler pajama sets, the matching outfits. Like the convenience of buying an outfit that's already put together for your kid is unmatched. I don't know, like for me it is, takes away the hassle of picking out an outfit in the morning for them. I don't have to put pieces together. You can buy total complete outfit sets. You can buy pajama sets. It just makes the stress of getting them ready, especially on Sunday mornings, like getting ready for church, getting out the door for church. I can just grab an outfit. I know which pieces go with what and we're good to go. I see you climbing up there. Carter's is a company that can grow with your child. They offer from newborn all the way up to face running, great promotional sales, and I can almost guarantee you you can find a style on their website that fits your aesthetic. From neutrals, basics, to colorful pieces, character pieces, you name it, they probably have it. Loving some of the pieces I picked up from their quarter three campaign. These pieces are available on their website right now, but I got the boys some fall staples, so Bellamy really needed some new sizes and pajamas, and I'm obsessed with this mustard set that is just so adorable, and I feel like you could swap the top and the bottom to be an outfit as well. You already know if you have a boy that these will be their new favorite pajamas. Bellamy's obsessed with cars, and I just love the colors on these. I went ahead and got the neck size up so that these will fit him for a lot longer, but we love the snug fit pajamas from Carter's. So be sure you head on over to Carter's website to check out whatever promotional deals they may be having going on at the time. And they always have clearance with the best markdown prices. You guys know I love a steal of a deal and their clearance section is always the best. They also have new arrivals for the fall season and the boys and girls clothes right now that they have on their website are seriously so precious. Now is the perfect time to start planning those holiday outfits for family get-togethers or family photos you may be having. And like I said, they have any aesthetic you could think of. They have colorful, neutrals, patterned character clothing. Just make sure you head over to their website to check out what they have and I'm sure you'll find something for your little one as well. And thank you so much to Carter's for for sponsoring today's video. Gotta change this boy out of his pajamas too, but especially you out of your fleece jammies because we're gonna go on a walk and it is hot out. So I'm gonna go ahead and put him in put him in his outfit for the day. I will have a link in the description box for you guys to shop their fall new arrivals and products because now is the time to start stocking up your kids' closets for the cooler weather and we absolutely love Carter's. Thank you again, Carter's, for sponsoring today's video and you guys can go ahead and check out the link in the description box. Get out the door soon for our W A L K. He just 
got himself a snack and asked to watch more music. Um, I think I showed a clip, but I've been ooh, starting the sleep timer now. I've been playing um, live worship sets, like sets where they film like a worship service and just playing that and he has not asked to watch Trash Truck, Dumb Belief, Toy Story, none of that. And it's been so healing for our home to just have worship, like live worship, watching people worship, not just music, playing and he loves to dance along to it. I love to dance along to it. We like take breaks throughout the day to worship. It's so beautiful. So he just fell asleep. I'm gonna make a latte and we'll go on a walk. much more comfortable. How about you wear hmm, these ones? No? What about, do you want to wear these ones? You can't wear those. Those are way too big for you. You want to wear those on our walk? in a workout and now I'm going to prep dinner really quick because I think we're going to go to the pool with our friends um, after nap time. So I'm going to do that and then hopefully I will have time. I'm like trying to get rid of some stuff. I'm going to list them in this local, in this Facebook group for people who are local to buy like used clothing, baby items, things like that off of me. And I'm going to work on cleaning up our room and stuff. And I need to pack because we're leaving this weekend for my brother's wedding. I need to put some makeup on. I look crazy. I have dark circles because I didn't take my mascara off last night. So I just look nuts. But I think I'm just going to do like a barbecue chicken situation. But I'm going to sear the chicken first on the pan. happens to me like often but I feel like I get rid of clothes pretty frequently and I still end up having like so much clothing that I don't love that I don't wear so I have this little box sitting in the corner of my closet and every time I put clothes away if it's a piece that I'm like why do I still own this it I toss it in that pile and once the pile is big enough I'm gonna go through and see like what's worth selling what's worth keeping what's worth donating <laughs> Um, or what's worth selling or donating and I'm slowly work my way through it but it's just like I'm tired of having so much stuff I go through this every year but especially lately I'm just like so ready to simplify our life in like every aspect that I possibly can and that starts with our home one downside to our laundry being in the basement is like I had to go all the way down to the basement. We have three stories and get all these clothes to pack and bring it up in this tote. But this is what Belle is going to wear at the wedding. So cute. And then this is the dress I'm going to wear. I rented it from Newly. And we still have to figure out what Austin's going to wear. Theo is baby. So I'm really not worried. I think he's just going to wear a onesie 
and to be honest I'll probably be wearing him if we're being honest but um I'm feeling so confused and like frazzled I don't really know where to start with all of these so I think I need to make a to-do list but I also think it's hard because he 